Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So we are inside my closet and I know a few of you have been asking me about what's inside my closet and what it looks like and this is really it. It's kind of hectic but I do try and colour coordinate it as much as I can. <laughs> as much as I can. As much. Well I do try. I try my best. <laughs> but anyway, um, I thought I'd do the video in here because I felt it's kind of fitting for the video and um, because I'm going to show you some jumpers that I got in the mail from Max Sweater and I'm so excited to try them on for you guys so stay tuned because I'm going to show you what they look like and what they look like on so without further ado, let's get started and I think that's it <laughs> Okay, so I have the sweaters here and I am missing one because I did wear it the other day and I put it in the wash so, <laughs> I didn't really plan this video out that well, as you can tell, um, but I will, if I find it and it's all clean, and then I'll put it at the end of this video so you guys can see it. <laughs> but it's pretty much similar to one of these, so you probably will get the idea. So, Max Sweaters does a very, well, a very, <laughs> a variety of different sweaters and jumpers and things like that, and I have always loved their sweaters. I think I have one or two back here that... I got on my own um, and this is not a paid ad or anything like that I'm just I got given them and I'm here to try them out and see how I like them so anyway <laughs> moving on so these sweaters are different kind of styles and I, I don't know what I've got I need to like hoover in here I think <laughs> I don't know I don't know what's happened in here the dogs always love running in here and just sniffing about and things like that so there's always something going on in here but anyway I am um, going off topic again so they do different types of sweaters they do ones well this one's an interesting one that i'm going to show you guys they do ones that are like buttons and then they have ones that are like this and i'm basically showing you everything already <laughs> and then there's ones that they have that are cropped um they have they're like a v like a v-neck it's kind of like i don't know but this is like the collar um and then little buttons um, or you could wear it as instead of a cardigan or anything like that you could wear it on top of a dress or something like that so they do have a lot of like varieties of different sweaters that you can try out and you can style so today I'm going to show you these ones so this one is a mustard yellow and it has these flowers over it and apologies for my nails they're a bit of a riot right now so <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> um so but this is what it looks like and it feels really really soft you guys um, and as you can see it kind of comes in here at the waist so when you put it on it kind of goes to sit like this so it's long enough so if you like to wear high-waisted skirts or capri pants or cigarette trousers or circle skirt whatever you feel or shorts <laughs> you know I love shorts and um, then you can do whatever you want with this and you can tuck it in because it's a good length and yeah it seems like you can put it over things too like even if you had a white blouse you could definitely put this over the top for sure because it kind of has a circular collar and you can have it come round or something like that or you can just wear it on your own i personally would probably wear this on my, on its own but it really is up to you what you feel like i have seen a few people actually put some sweaters over like a circle dress or something like that and they always look so cute so maybe if you had a dress that was maybe one of these solid colors then you could put this over the top and it adds a little extra something a little extra to it so yeah so i really like this one um, the next one is this kind of dark navy um, button up sweater, as you can see, it is again around the same length, probably a little bit longer. Um, it doesn't come in at the waist as much, no, it kind of comes in a little bit at the bottom, but not really. Um, and this one, you can't even see my face, I just realised. <laughs> but this one, um, obviously you could wear over a dress or over an outfit that you're wearing, or you could wear it on its own, like it's something that again you can wear it any way that you feel like and that's what I really like about these sweaters because from the ones that I've had before I just wore them on their own and with dresses or like a something else just to put it on so it's definitely it's good to have these things especially when it gets cold at night and even if it's in summer or you're on holiday or whatever you whatever, which is any temperature really um you can always layer it up and it'll always look really cute so I definitely love these jumpers if you can't tell but this one okay this one I, I know it looks really weird it looks like a scarf I know you guys it's really bizarre but this one is actually it is a sweater so I will show you how I put it on but it is very weird it did take me a few attempts to get this one right <laughs> so this is kind of what it looks like it kind of looks like a shawl and it's really long actually 
um, with like some weird sleeve things going on. It's very bizarre. But what you do with this is you can do like just whatever style you really feel like doing with it, but it's a wrap round. So you'd wrap it round and then it crosses over like this. You can put it off the shoulder, or you can lift it up and you put your arms in and then that's really it really. <laughs> and for me, I'm still trying to get used to this one. But I definitely will show you how to wear it and how I style it. So you guys, if you, you if you really like it and you really want to try this style out, then at least I'll show you how to wear it. At least how I like to wear it. Um. So yeah, this one I still really like because I love like thick material um sweaters and it is cozy and it is something that's a little bit more. I know it sounds weird, but like a little bit more sexy compared to other ones that are coming up to right up here. It's kind of nice to have something off the shoulders. I really like showing off this part here <laughs> um, so it is nice um, but again it's a little bit challenging to put on but once you get used to it it seems okay so <laughs> without further ado you guys I'm going to show you how I style all of these jumpers so you can see what they look like on and yeah <laughs> I'll speak to you more at the end bye I don't want to say bye <laughs> why did I say bye is <laughs> you guys are still here <laughs> Okay, so here is the first one. It's just a cardigan and I tucked into some capris from Vixen by Micheline Pitt and I have a little velvet belt. And this is one style that I would wear this cardigan with. And you can also tuck it in to make it look like a v-neck. So it's kind of cool. <laughs> and yes, yeah, so I do this with some of my cardigans a lot. <laughs> okay, so this is the one that I was talking about, the wrap one. Um, and you just kind of wrap it around and then put your arms through the sleeves and again I paired it with the capris and you can also you can lift the sleeves up if I get them right <laughs> and you can I don't know you can lift it up to like so you don't show your shoulders and yeah so this is this one <laughs> Okay, so this is the last one and this is a really cute sweater and I paired it with some red high-waisted shorts and a red belt. Now all of it is vintage apart from the first one, well true vintage, and this one is a retro one. But it's super cute with flowers and again you can put it with anything. Okay you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was another kind of short but sweet video of just unboxing and trying things on, but I hope you enjoyed it and again apologies for not being as active on Instagram this week. Um, I know I didn't say it at the beginning, I meant to say it at the beginning, but I'd forgotten until now. <laughs> um, I just had so much work stuff going on this week that I didn't actually have time to take any new pictures or video, make any new videos or any more content for you guys. So I was really sad because I always love talking to you all um, and communicating with you all and posting some new things. Um, so I'm really sorry, but I'll be back to normal next week um, and also with this video. So I'm really happy that I get to film again, which is nice. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you guys know first when I post a new video. <laughs> so I hope you have a great weekend and I will speak to you all very, very soon. Bye.